The endless summer cruising event will take place in Ocean City this weekend. For the second time in two weeks, the town has a special event zone in place. This comes just days after the major traffic from Ocean's Calling Music Festival. Coast TV News reporter Alisa Weber shows us what the extra regulations are and what people think about them. Tani Baku owns Mitchell's Market located on Philadelphia Ave in Ocean City. Baku says the special event zone, which lowers speed limits and increases fines, is important. It's for safety of the people and uh, kids, of course, families, and it keeps the town safer, especially when there's a lot of people around the town. A special event zone is in place until October 8th. The town says its goal is to keep people safe during the endless summer cruising event this weekend. Mike Rhodes, who is a frequent visitor to Ocean City, believes increasing consequences for speeders and reckless drivers is a good idea. I do, I do, and, it, and it'll give people the incentive not to speed, you know. So yeah, I, I, I do believe that, that that works, yes. The Ocean City Police Department brings this back every year. It was first brought about after the H2OI pop-up car rally. The special event zone has been an amazing tool for law enforcement and keeping the town safe over the past couple of years. And throughout the years, we've adjusted that. We got the legislation first approved back in 2018. We were still seeing that kind of reckless behavior of burnouts, intersection takeovers, and their speed contests. So then we went back to got the additional legislation back in 2020, where that made the exhibition driving offenses arrestable. Maryland State Police and the Worcester County Sheriff's Department will be assisting the Ocean City Police Department enforce all rules that are associated with the special event zone planning. Ocean City, Emily Swaber, Coast TV News.